Imagine their surprise when a federal way couple gets a knock on their door from a police officer last night, letting them know their RV was stolen from a secured lot. On top of it all, they found out their stolen RV was involved in a police chase. They say this isn't the first time something crazy like this has happened and they are fed up. It's not something you see every day. A brazen thief steals an RV and then slams into a police car. The RV in the video that smashed the police car, that was ours, that was here. Rick and Tracy Workman were shocked to find out how it happened. So they cut the fence. My RV was right here, and it, it didn't take long. Someone broke into this storage lot off of 20th Avenue South late Tuesday night and stole their RV. And then, I mean, what are they doing with it? That's the that's what I scratch in my head about. It's are they taking it to the woods to live in it or? on the way out of the lot? The thief slamming through this gate, leaving skid marks and gravel and leading the police on this chase. They're getting more brazen about it and people are starting to get hurt now. They say it's not the first time. This is the third incident for us here. The second incident with our motor home and they're fed up. It's progressively gotten worse the last three years. Now they're making plans to move. But we might move our plans up because it's just seems to be just it's getting worse it's every day. They're fearful the barbed wire, the gates, security cameras won't be enough to stop thieves from trying it again. Look at the razor. I mean, look how they have tried to secure this place. We have lights and it doesn't deter them. They're getting bolder and bolder, more brazen. Yeah, the officer involved in this incident was not seriously hurt. Police are still searching for the suspect involved. For now, we are live in Federal Way. Britt Moore, King 5 News.